Hey, John, how's it going? Yep, no, I'm good. Hey, we're thriving, man. Yeah, we got more appointments out this week than any in the last couple months, I think. Yep. How's everything? How's your little girl, the one that, uh, she just got out of college, right? Oh, that's why you're calling. Oh, what's up? Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, the job market is really hard right now, especially if you have no experience. Um, what are you thinking? Huh. You think she'd be interested in something like that? I mean, that's, uh, it's a lot of contact with actors. I mean, they can be pretty difficult. True, yeah, I've done it done it for a long time but I have I, I'm you know I'm used to it now and I was trained by some really great people what do you think that she could have a, like an internship somewhere or she's really set on making money huh yeah we all are aren't we um I don't know, man. A lot of people that get hired, they have internships first. Right. Well, let me think. If I... Hold on one second. Oh, man. I really don't want to do this. Daddy calls him just gets a little job. Doesn't earn her way up. I don't know, man. He's one of your best friends. Just help him out for a little bit. Okay, here we go. Hey, bro, so here's what I'm thinking. Um, I think we can definitely help her out. We already have a general assistant that helps the five agents. There's five agents at the office, and we sort of have her send out all our additions that we get from the casting directors to our clients. And because a lot of those come from me, we can sort of lessen her workload a little bit and have your daughter come on as acting as my personal assistant. And that'll significantly also lessen the workload of our general assistant. So we'll start her on uh, an hourly. If she really likes it, we could think of something more long term. Yeah, definitely room for growth. If that's if that's something she finds she ends up being interested in, then definitely. And then if that happens, of course, we'll move her from an hourly to a salary position. Yep. Man, I wish I had a dad like you when I was coming up. These kids don't know how lucky they have it, right? So when does she get in? Uh, you wanted to talk to me first. Well, I could, uh, hey, I could start her as soon as Monday. Yeah. Are you dropping her off? Oh, that's great, man. So then why don't you come down? This is great. This is perfect. You come down. We'll catch up. We'll go get dinner. We'll go out. What? No, no. No, man. We're not going to do it like we did back in the day. That's. I think those days are, are pretty over. My liver can't handle it. <laughs> Oh, good. Uh, where is she staying, by the way? You going to get a hotel? or Man, it's expensive, man. You don't want to put out all that money. Can you find a sublet? Or... Yeah, I know everything's so overpriced right now. I tell you what, I have an extra guest room if you want her to stay with me until she figures something else out. Yeah, man, why not? No one's using it. Exactly. Plus, you can walk to the office from here, so that's a big plus. Yeah, perfect. Alright, bro, so you think you'll get in uh, Friday, like, early evening? Amazing. Alright, man. 
Yeah, totally. Hey, hey, you were the one that helped me get my first job out of college, so... It was an unpaid internship, but... Yeah, so I'm happy to do it. Happy to do it. All right, man. All right, I'm excited. See you soon. Bye. I'm telling you, you're going to love this guy. He's classically trained, but he's got a totally contemporary edge. It, hang on one second. Well, hello, it's the princess herself. Just give me one second, I'm on the phone. Yep. Yep, yeah, perfect, yo. Just send the docu sign and we'll get that all squared away. Okay, great. All right, you have a good weekend, man. All right, thanks. Yep, bye. Come on in, princess. Well, I mean, your daddy's little princess, right? He got you the hookup, got you a job, a paying job right out of college. That's pretty, uh, it's pretty special. No, I'm teasing you. Hey, listen, thank you for uh, coming straight to the office. I know me and your dad were going to do a thing, but uh, work just got overwhelming and I had to come in on a Saturday. Yep, yeah, but so, hold on, is this all your stuff? All right, just give me that. <clears throat> I'll just put this all over here. So look, today I'll just show you around and, uh, you know, explain a few things, but um, you won't have to do actually any work today, but we'll call it your first payday. Um, we'll log it in the books as a day of work, but I'll just show you around real quick. All right. Sound good. Great. Okay. So mostly what you'll be doing is confirming the appointments that I get the actors with the actors. So I'll send you the time. I'll send you the location and, uh, you'll confirm all of that with the actors. This is where you're going to be. Yep. Right next to the other assistant. Yep, and she handles all of the agents. You'll just be handling my appointments. Nope, just me. Will that be okay with you? Good. So, we also have a lot of meetings. So, when people come in, you'll ask them if they need any water, any snacks, and then direct them there to the couch where they can wait for us. Yep. Easy peasy. And we'll ask you for things here and there, but that'll, that's mainly what you'll be doing. Yep, and then when you get started on your actual first day, uh, we'll have the other assistant give you a nice little training so you can understand how we streamline our emails and everything. Mm-hmm. And if you see, these are all the other agents' offices. Yep. Yeah, I'm the only one here today. Had to come in on a Saturday. Can't let this place burn down, you know. God, how long is it since I've seen you? Four Christmases ago? And you've grown up so much since then. Oh, I look the same, huh? <laughs> well, I guess we're both giving each other compliments. Yeah, exactly. What do you think about being in the big city? Yeah, it's a little crazy. Yeah, it can be overwhelming, but I think you'll get used to it pretty fast. And I know you haven't been to my apartment yet, but it's extremely close. So it's like a probably a 10 minute walk. Yep. Exactly. And I've got a great apartment. I mean, there's a pool in the back that it's, it's shared with uh, the other tenants at the building. And there will be days where you could work from home. So if you want to just lounge by the pool, do some work. Yeah. I'm telling you, man, you have it a lot easier than I did when I got out of school. <laughs> yep. I think I'm going to have to nickname you Princess the whole time you're here. No, you won't mind that. <laughs> if it fits. <laughs> yeah, okay, my little princess. Well, I think that's about everything here, so... What's that? Oh, my office is just over here. That one in the corner, yeah. 
You want to see it? Yeah, sure. Why not? Come on. Oh, those on the wall? Yeah, those are all movies that our clients have been in. Yep. Yeah, we're really proud of what we've discovered here. We've discovered some great talent. Okay, this is it. Hey, hey, I didn't start at an office like this. Took me a while to work my way up here. Nobody gets to a corner office with floor-to-ceiling windows without having to kiss a bunch of ass and work real hard. What do you mean, whose ass did I have to kiss? Huh. Well, you'll learn. If you find out that this is an industry that you want to be a part of and you want to be an agent one day, you'll see you've got to be nice to a whole bunch of people you don't want to be nice to. But you can also be a shark. I'm sure you'll hear me defend my clients with a lot of integrity. I don't let anybody fuck with my clients. It's a long relationship we have together. And for those where it's short, it's a long relationship we're investing in. You like that? Me too. All right, come on. Let's get you settled in. I told this guy my client is not going to go in for any of this regional theater stuff. Oh, hey, princess. What is this? You made me a mojito. <laughs> okay. Um, wow, that's a nice bathing suit. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah, I was just doing some work. We're both working from home today, right? Yeah, so just uh, trying to get some work done by the pool. Didn't know you were going to be here. I thought you were uh, going out with your friends today. Yeah, no, I mean, but it's slow. I thought you were going to go get a coffee or something with the people you met through at that party, right? Okay, so you're just... All right, well, I guess we can just... Work side by side, uh, kicking it at the pool. You know what? Actually, I think um, I might go back inside to do work. It's getting kind of hot out here. No, no, no. You're not making me leave. I just uh, I don't want the computer to get overheated. Yeah, you're right. Why not just hang around for a little bit? No, no, no. You're right. It's a gorgeous day. You're, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Totally. We have to enjoy our lives. Yep. Okay. So are you like a beach girl? Something? You seem real comfortable in a bikini. A uh, very small bikini. Yeah. Well, I'm sure they got a lot of great beaches where you're from. I'm sorry. Put lotion on your back. Yeah. Uh, sure, 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 sure. Why not? Yeah. Yeah, I'll make sure I get under the strap. Sure. <clears throat> Oh, you feel pretty tense. I'm not working you too hard, am I? No? Okay. No, I don't think either of us are working that hard right now. You're kind of a distraction. Well, I mean, this is just really good company to have out here, so I don't feel too inspired to be fighting to get my clients' jobs right now. That's not a good thing. What do you mean, how are you distracting? You just came out of here in a string bikini and gave me a mojito while I was working on my laptop. You don't think that would be distracting to any man? 
Maybe I'm distracting you. <laughs> I was out here doing my work. No, I'm not fully clothed either, but don't make me get into a I was here first conversation. Where's your laptop? How are you going to do work out here without your laptop? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I suppose you could do everything from your phone, but, uh... Okay, whatever. Well, let's get to it. After you go for a swim. <laughs> go ahead. Oh, my God. This girl is fucking perfect. Jesus, she's so fucking hot. Oh, she's moving like that on purpose. She has to be. God, how am I going to get any fucking work done while she's here? What the fuck is going on? Bringing me fucking mojitos and shit, Jesus. Um. Hey, you know what, princess? Yeah, no, I think my computer's overheating. I'm just gonna go ahead and, and go inside, okay? Oh my god. Yep. All right. No, no, no. It's fine. I'm just gonna go work inside. Yes. Great. Fuck. Can't believe I'm here doing another all nighter. Oh man, my god. Probably not getting my work done because of a little missed thing over here. Coming in here every day wearing the tightest dress she can find. Where the fuck does she even get these dresses? God, her dad must have flooded her bank account. Okay, come on, man. Think. Work on your stuff. It would help if you'd come back with those coffees. Oh, here she is. Hey, princess. Thank you. We're going to need these. Yep. I might be here doing an all-nighter. Because film contracts, they're really different than theater contracts. It just takes a lot of scrutinizing, and I've been a little distracted. Oh. <clears throat> nothing, nothing, nothing. You just uh, kind of rubbed up against me when you're giving me the call. It's fine. It's fine. You... You do do that a lot, though, you know that, right? When you pass me, you kind of rub up against me. Your love language is physical touch. <laughs> okay. Well, we're not in love, so... Guess it's just part of your personality? Okay. All right, well, uh, I guess we better get back at it so we can get out of here. Oh, by the way, um, you know, this isn't the 90s. You don't have to wear pencil skirts and high heels to work every day. It's, you like to. Huh. Okay. If, I mean, I just thought it might be a little bit uncomfortable. You're very comfortable. Does it make me uncomfortable? Why do you ask that? No. No, I'm not asking you to change. I just... You know what? It doesn't matter. How about you go finish on uh, getting the information for those appointments, and uh, I'll get back to work in here. All right. Great. I'll let you know if I need anything else. Thanks. Oh, my God. 
What am I gonna do? I'm so funny. She keeps wearing the sluttiest things at home and in the office. She's definitely flirting with me. She's definitely, definitely flirting with me, but fuck, that is one of my best friend's daughters, man. Come on. <sighs> okay, focus. We can do this. God damn, it's getting so fucking late. I gotta get out of here. It would be really helpful if I could not see her from my office. <clears throat> or if there were other people here. That would keep my mind from going to this dirty fucking place. Got two people alone in the fucking office. Jesus. Is she staring at me? Why does she keep staring and smiling at me? What is she doing? Why is she coming in here? Oh, God. Princess, what are you doing? Is there something you need help with? It's the same filing system that we've been doing on all the other. All right, I'll come over there and show you. <clears throat> show you from my computer. Yeah, I mean, I guess I could do that if... Okay, um, all right, come around. Oh my god, are you, are you wearing perfume? Jesus fucking Christ. Huh? No, nothing, I'm just muttering to myself. Okay, why don't you take my seat and I'll direct you from over your shoulder. Are you gonna sit down? What do you mean, why am I staring at you? I got up out of my seat so that you could sit there and have a better look at the screen. But you're not sitting down. I could make you sit down? Oh, princess. You really are. Is this what you fucking wanted? I'm coming in here every fucking day. In these little dresses. You know exactly what you were fucking doing. The perfume is fucking new. Don't think I didn't notice that. That's what you fucking wanted, right? Huh? You've been fucking staring at my house, lounging by the pool in a thong bikini. Mm. You've been wanting me to fuck you since day one. Mm. 